Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. This is week 3 assignment of the course Ethical Hacking. Guys, for the past 5 to 6 years, we have been providing solutions for various courses, including Ethical Hacking as well. So guys, please watch the video till the end. Don't skip the video guys. You may miss some content if you do so. Please watch full video. Don't skip that. And if you are new to our channel, definitely subscribe our channel and definitely like the video. Then only our videos will reach more number of students and that they will also get benefited like you. And please share this with your friends and classmates. Which of the following statements is or are false? So for first question, first option is the probable solution guys. IP protocol uses connection oriented routing. So this is the false statement. So they are also asking about false statement, right? So this is not true. Guys, these are completely our probable solutions. If there are any changes that come to our notice, definitely we will update that in the comment section. If we if we de detect ourselves, you can also suggest your solutions in the comment section, right? Next, second question. A routing table entry that is manually configured remains unchanged. Unchanged means static, right? So mark second option. Option B as the probable solution. Next, third one. Which of the following statement is false? about direct and indirect packet delivery so for third question fourth option none of these none of the above three statements are false so option d next fourth question which of the following statements correctly describe feature of dynamic routing so for fourth question there are three probable solutions the first one is option B, routing table updates periodically depending on the network condition. Next, option C, routers exchange control information which consumes networks, network resources. And the other one is option D, it can automatically find alternate paths during link failures. So, B, C and D. Next, fifth question. In the routing table, which of the following flags indicates the route uses a gateway to reach the destination? So for sixth question, second option G is the probable solution. So mark option B as the probable option. So before getting into the seventh question, I want to make a small announcement. So that is regarding exam preparation MCQs. Exam preparation MCQs guys for the course. Right? So guys, for the course Ethical Hacking, you have got the exam preparation MCQs. These are past NPTEL assignment MCQs. You are going to get a huge number of 300 MCQs guys. 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link. So 300 MCQs for one person 300, for two to five persons. That means if you take it along with your friends or classmates combinedly, for two to five persons, the combined price is 500. So if, suppose five members take, five members are there in your group and 5 members want to take the pack then for 500 all the 5 members can take that so 2 to 5 members the price is 500 rupees guys so please share this news with your friends and classmates and purchase this pack guys mail me to this email id so select your group and one member from the group take the lead and mail me to this email id bk1794178 at gmail.com so this is our mail id guys already many students and even professors have also taken our pack so take it now itself to get more time to prepare so take it now itself guys so you can save your time so such option is available guys you can search any question you want easy to revise mcqs validity will be till the exam results day so till the exam results day you will continue to have the access coverage will be high syllabus high syllabus will be covered within less time so huge number of 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link for one person 300 for two to five persons combined find it. So please share this news with your friends and classmates in your WhatsApp student groups, unofficial groups and make some discussion happen on this and mail me to this email id. I will give the same email id in the de description box also. So that's it guys. So think about that. Already many students and even professors have also taken our pack. So that's it guys. Now let's get back to the solutions. So seventh question, which of the following statements about the default route is incorrect? So we know that it is the default address, but they are asking incorrect. So you have to read the question carefully. So incorrect is this one, right? Option B guys. 
so mark option for seventh question right now let's move on to the eighth one oh sorry guys uh, this is not the eighth one sixth one so which of the following states uh, statement about default root is incorrect so this is not uh, i mean the second one option b is the correct option correct option is correct only but this is not the seventh question this is sixth question right sixth question option b the option is correct only guys 100% correct right next which of the following routing protocol suffers from count to infinity problem so seventh question option c rip option c is the probable solution guys next which of the following routing protocols is used for routing between different autonomous systems so for eighth question also option c bgp is the probable solution guys bgp next ninth question in ospf routing protocol which of the following packets is used to check if the neighbor is neighbor router is up that means if the neighbor router is active or not so option b hello packet is the probable solution guys hello packet and moving on to the last question that is 10th one which of the following statement is false for ipv6 so for 10th question first option ipv supports address like a b and c this is the probable solution so friends these are these are the most probable solutions for week 3 assignment of the course ethical hacking so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same definitely subscribe our channel definitely like the video guys and don't forget to purchase this huge number of 300 mcqs pack you'll get that in a google drive pdf restricted link validity will be till the exam results day guys validity will be till the exam results day so no need to worry about the validity you'll have a long validity for that and huge number of 300 mcqs you are going to get in a google drive pdf restricted link for one person 300 for two to five persons combinedly 500 guys with five to six years of nptl experience we are providing this for the course ethical hacking guys so this is the mail id bk179417 at the rate gmail.com mail me to this email id this is the mail id guys so make some discussion happen on this so please share this news with your friends and classmates and one person from the group mail me to this email id guys so that's it guys for this video so keep supporting us like this your support is very important for us in order to continue continue to upload the videos guys so that's it guys for this video so until the next video goodbye thank you